Tom Sullivan of Aurora, Colorado. My son, Alex Sullivan, was murdered in the Aurora Theater Massacre on July 20th of 2012 by a man with a 100 round magazine. This is going to be my first Father's Day without Alex. And what that means to me is that Alex will perpetually be a young boy and a young man. Uh, I will never see him grow to be a father. Uh, I'll never see him be an uncle to his, to his sister's children. I'll, I'll never see him be a, be a mentor, be a coach. Um, I'll never have that opportunity um, to be presented with a, with a grandchild um, like I did to my father and, and brought him, you know, both you know, my, my son and, and my daughter. And we'll never have the opportunity to have those father-son, grandchild outings of going to the to the ball game, going to the park, you know, going shopping, you know, figuring out how to fix a flat tire or any of those kinds of things. Those are all going to be taken away from me and I'll never get to experience those and see what kind of a man Alex is going to grow up to be, uh, what kind of an impact he would, he would make to uh, not only his, his family and, and, and our family, but to community around him. And I'm, uh, yeah. the, from here on out, what we this, this this can't happen. It has to stop happening to, to fathers around the, the, the country here. Uh, we need to do something about uh, you know this gun violence and you know make, make people aware of what's happening and and. The, Get uh, you know, get 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 some laws enacted that uh, people can can follow. Some common sense laws. I mean, background checks. Um, you know, these high capacity magazines. There's no there's no point in, in in those. And we need to at least start a dialogue amongst people instead of getting the angry you know voices that that come out and the recalls and all of that. That doesn't do anybody any good. What we need to do is begin a conversation, come up with some common sense ideas to try to avert this so that there's other fathers that don't have to go through and, and have you know, empty Father's Days like I'm going to be having for the rest of my life.